this is P Bunny and I'm back. Oh, I'm back. Hey, and this is P Bunny Travels the World. I'm back with a jump off. Hey, hey, hey. I'm back. <laughs> um, so this is of course P Bunny Travels. Um, I'm come. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. Um, today I'm going to talk to you guys about one of my trips I've been to this past year. The trip I've been to, which is Jamaica, Jamaica. If you don't follow me on Instagram, Happy Bunny Three or Five, um, go follow me. One and two. On um, there, I went ahead and I asked people which video would they like to see next in Jamaica. One. So we went ahead and picked Jamaica, Jamaica. Mr. Lava, Lava. Hmm. So. I picked Jamaica, or they picked Jamaica, so that's what I'm going to talk to you guys today about. I'm doing two type of videos. One video, which is going straight to the point, telling you everything I did in Jamaica, from activity, 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 um, and letting you know what I did on each day, the hotel I stayed at, and things in that nature. The second video that I'm going to do is going to be more in depth, more longer, giving you my 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 interest of it, or what my experience was in Jamaica of every activity I went to, and things of that nature. So, stay tuned, buckle up, because we're gonna be on a ride. And these two videos, tell me which video you like. If you like the faster one, the the, the longer one, let me know your opinion. Comment below. So stay tuned. Be bunny travels the world. Yeah, yeah. It's all mine, but sometimes I just want somebody to talk to. Someone that's on This is P Bunny Travels, and we're talking about Jamaica, Jamaica Wanda. Okay, so today, I mean, this one is going to be the quicker one, going to details of what we did. Um, we flew into Jamaica on a Friday. Um, our hotel went ahead and picked us up. We stayed at the Royal in Montego Bay. Um, that hotel was amazing. It's beautiful. The hospitality was wonderful. Everybody there was just great. The food was mm, 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 mm. the food was good. It had multiple pools. I'm gonna put some videos right here. It was an amazing experience. Um, over there, they had night activities as well as day activities for people. Um, so it was a whole vibe at the hotel. A whole vibe. Um, first day we stayed in. We didn't do anything really on the first day. The next day, which is Saturday, we had a whole day. We went ahead and used Level D Vibe Tour and Transportation. I'm gonna put that information right here. Amazing. When I tell you amazing, amazing. You will not regret using them at all. They're patient, they're kind, they're helpful, they give you ideas. Awesome. They have their own website so you can see how much stuff costs, prices. If you don't know what to do, you can go on their website and see different activities that they have for different locations. Amazing. And they're able to help you with the pricing and things that are the bigger the party, the cheaper the prices. So amazing. I would highly recommend when I go back to Jamaica. This is the people that I'm using hands down. This is the people I'm using. So go ahead and book them. Um, for the first place that we went to we went to um Bob Marley um Bob Marley Home Museum um that was in St. Anne in Jamaica it was like two hours or hour and a half somewhere around there to get over there to that side of where Bob Marley Home was it was a beautiful tour we had a great time we had a great person that um led our tour and gave us information regarding Bob Marley and things of that nature um uh, from there we left there we went to the um we went to go eat at Scott Scotchies. Um, I didn't eat there, but everyone else ate. They didn't have the things that I wanted, but they said that the food was good. Uh, from there, we went to Bamboo Rafting. Um, bamboo Rafting, you could do it at a different location. This one was closer to where we were or on our way. Um, so that one was amazing. We had a fun time, me and my brother. We shared a raft. Um, from there we went to Blue Hole, <clears throat> which Blue Hole, you jump off of a cliff into a water or to a, you know, top of water, top of water, that's all I'm going to say, stay tuned for the longer video. Um, 
And then from there, we left there. We went back to the hotel. Once we went back to the hotel, we got ready to go out that night. Um, we went to go eat dinner. Yum, 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 yum. The food was amazing. Because um, I was looking for... Watch the next video. Anyways, this food was amazing. We went to the club. We went to Margaritaville. Uh, once we went to Margaritaville, the place was lit. Oh, oh. It's a very popular club there. A lot of uh, tourists as well as local people there. So it was fun and exciting. We had a great time, me and my brother. The next day was a chill day. We went to buy souvenirs. Went to the souvenir strip to go buy different souvenirs. And then from there, we went back to Margaritaville during the day. We had... Um, Icy or daiquiris, icy daiquiris. Um, I have food, I have a burger there over here, and it was good, it was a vibe just chilling in there. And then from there, we went to the dip lagoon. Which, you when you go into the water, the water has this blue, pretty blue water, it was so pretty, like so pretty, so like so pretty. Go do it, like go do it. I didn't jump out the water because I can't swim, but you know everybody else jumped out the water. They was able to make the water blue, and it was pretty. So it was a great experience. We went there, and then after that we went back to the hotel. We got ready. We went to. We got ready to go to the club. It was like a club lounge, which is called Twenty Seven Twenty Seven. My brother's a hookah fanatic. And so we had to find a hookah bar for him. And, you know, it's his birthday celebration, too, because his birthday was earlier that month. So we had to celebrate his birthday with it. Um, we went to the hookah. He got a hookah. We vibed out. We saw Florida was there. Welcome to my house. I put bottom jeans. Hey! Uh, which was, it was fun. I, he, I was able to take a picture with him. I danced. I had a great time. Um, we went back to the um, back to the hotel. Made sure we packed everything for the next morning. Um, checked out the hotel. Then we went to go take pictures at the um, Montego Bay sign over here. Um, and then from there we went to um, Coral Cliff game and casino which is like a whole arcade game downstairs like different type of games which was like a like i found that on the whim because the outside building as you can see right here we saw it the first night i went out and i was like what is this place this place is dope um but it was exciting downstairs is arcade upstairs is a real casino we did that before our flight once we left there we head back to the hotel um then they went ahead and gave us a ride to the airport and then we left so it was an amazing time we had a great time in jamaica i am definitely going back and i'm using this company like i said um to go back and i'm going back to the same hotel because like i said it was amazing i had so much fun like so much fun um, at the hotel, one of the things that they had was um, an all-white party, which I did not know, so I wore all black. <laughs> but it was fun. It was exciting. We were playing good music. We were dancing outside. So it was an amazing time. So if you're going to Jamaica, please hit these places that I said. You will have a great time. If you want me to go in more depth, watch my other video, which will give you more information regarding each place I went to and more, and more information regarding that. So stay tuned. So this is P-Bunny Travels. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Leave comments. Tell me if you like this type of video. Do you like the longer video? Let me know what you like. And you can tell I sing so much. And I hate musicals. But that's just has the point. But yeah. So let me know what you think. Tell me if you've been to Jamaica. What places you've been to. And things. And what did you do there? Let me know in the comments. And maybe when I go back to Jamaica. I could go ahead and do them things. You know what I mean? So talk to you guys later. Bye.